See if they can find it. I want a little bit of Nevera. I want to just chop up a little Ziwu and sprinkle that on top. I want Vitality's pieces to really come into fruition. And well, there's the main dish for you. Ziwu opening up with the pistol headshot. Apex, that's an easy kill. Ziwu actually with the double flash assist through mid. Nevera's position back plat, just shutting down this B play. And poor Big Clan are going to find nothing. So it seems here in the opening pistol. Just beautiful. Get you a man that could do it all. Ziwu. Name of the game. Yeah. Scout shot. Misses the mark. Ooh, Apex. Good thing. Him and Nevera were both kind of eyes up in that spot. Ziwu now deciding that he wants to go on a tear. He's let them get close enough. Ziwu with two and a half kills on this one. As RPK comes in from long for a frag and assist of his own. Yeah, uh, the other day. Absolutely dumpstered phase on Dust2. Looked incredible on their T-side. Ah, Searson. It's a Searson. Searson. A great map for him, of course, as well. Man, did he ever look good versus Complexity Amazing. earlier. I do think that that's going to be kind of one of the talking points in this series. Is Let's see if we can get the Searson to beat Complexity. But Apex can't drop shots like that. <laughs> and Tizian going to go ahead and punish RPK before he can even pick up any sort of pieces. There is nothing here for Vitality. A five versus two, in fact. And Big Clan, easily gonna walk into this B-bomb site, you'd think. Nevera, time to be tested. Cuts down the cat player. Oh, and gets the second? He has another bit of a chance, but at that point, they're so focused on him. Ziwu takes the player off the back and maybe had a chance there. He's gotta turn it up a bit. Keto will be dinked, but the AK bests the MP9, and for that reason, 5v3. Wow, crazy to see how active Tizian has gotten on these T-sides, really moving very quickly, a lot of entries from him. Ouch. So I'm flying out of B-holes on Mirage versus FaZe. Low HP, again, on two of these players from Big. Smoke Grenade could give them that exit route. Taps and decides to walk through. A little double spray down, just picking up the pieces, padding the stats. He is now officially on the scoreboard. This was a big one. The yeah. booby trap in Tizian sitting on his boxes. Mm, nice pick, too. No sniper for Vitality, but Ziwu will tuck long A. I'm seeing him more at long A than, than I feel like he tends to be. And it is still early days. Ziwu swinging out, maybe thinking that because there's so much presence, he's going to get contact. You want Ziwu in those high impact positions. Apex, another chance. But with both players so low, Tizian and Tabson still able to survive. How do they get away with it round after round? Impact, opening impact from Tizian. We can't stop saying it. He's doing such a great job with these first frags. And that's a double setup towards long. It's a couple of situations where people are going to get there first before you. You don't want to miss out. And of course, the ZT's got better spawns over on long, but that doesn't stop T's from coming. We don't know for the time being. Ziwu, and you give this guy an inch, and he's gonna track it through a door and shoot your ass down to four HP. Tabson, lucky to be alive. Ziwu gonna peek around the front of this, and sure enough, he kills Keto. Man advantage for Vitality. Oh, this is annoying. They're, They're gonna, gonna just put a lot of emphasis on that mid fake. Oh, they've lost their bomb as well. Apex, he gets his 10th kill of the map. Now going for more repeats. Tizian with another headshot, trying to recuperate with a swift entry. Ziwu finding kill after kill here. It's all good for Vitality. Four survivors, a 3K on Ziwu. I Not going this. too well. Just the walk up. Yeah. They lay down their own smoke. Nevera with another chance. Stop the bomb carrier, but Keto gets Apex immediately. Now Nevera's starting to piece it together, and Ziwu off of the catwalk. It's his chance in a one versus three. Immediate impact, but Searson watches Smoke Gap and Big Clan back in the lead. They take it. Nevera. Oh, boy. Ooh, he hits him. Oh, he hits him. Frag grenade can make the move. Oh, Keto through the smoke. You want to shoot me? Take that, Shocks. Now he's got himself tucked into behind car. Flashbang going through, Shocks. 
not going to be able to make a move. Ziwu dies to the mid play. Tapson will drop after that first one. Shoxi can line them. Two players off of him, and Apex has a double. Last man's rounding the corner. Tizian versus RPK. And RPK, with a health advantage, gets the better of the timing. Vitality tie at six. For once, he's on the right side of the timing over on the other side of the map. RPK rotating in. See what they make of the four pistol play up catwalk. Frag grenade from Ziwu. Bada boom. Tabson, Zanteras, and Searson all softened. There are flashes here to set up RPK. Looks like the CTs are going to try and get this going, but Zanteras, all knowing, finds two Deagle headshots. Now it's Tabson's turn. Searson adds one to the tally. Suddenly a four versus two turn 4v1. It's done. Big clan. Give them the space and you'll regret it. No opt for Vitality. Opening Pearson spawn again. Ooh. Instantly finding Ziwu on long, and he sticks around a bit. Oh no my way. god, he re-peeks into Apex. They were talking about this on the desk, dude. The confidence on Big is good, and it's strong after dismantling complexity. You can understand why. Mm -hmm. But he knew he just took down Ziwu, so like it's not Nevera who's going to be up next. Sure. Took some damage, hit the shot. Good timing here on Shox's play, but... He's taken out of it. Tizian has been very impactful this map. He is 15 and 8. Yeah, amazing. Amazing T-side from him. Tizian and Keto, in fact, leading the scoreboard for big. Searson not far off. Nevera in the tunnels, gonna get hunted by Tizian, but he will fall. Tapson looks to trade this, and oh my god, it is Vitality across the kill feed. Keto suddenly has to clutch this in a one versus two, and he won't. Whoa. Nevera coming in with impact, the master of dust two, it seems. Okay, now we're gonna get the pistol round, and that half had one misstep, you know, the eco round. Mm -hmm. But now we're into the next pistol. This is what all this is what matters. 13 and 8 now for Nevera, an opening kill pistol round to right. trade here as well. And this score, is, score gets pretty steep. Oh my god. Okay, Ziwu gets him. Gets him from a little further back. Man advantage. Although because of Tabson's frag grenade on catwalk, Nevera and RPK are incredibly low. Keto catching Ziwu now drops him to 39 health, and there's nowhere for Ziwu to go. Hmm. He tries to throw a flash for himself, but doesn't go for the aim duel. Keto makes the most of it in that moment, and now... It's 2v2. Neither CT playing off of the kit. Zanteres should have just quit. Didn't even have a chance versus RPK. Keto trying to find these individual 1v1s, but with 3 HP to make the difference. And you gotta remind yourself, he is human. Ah. Frag grenades, Ooh. nipping at the heels of Nevera. He throws a flashbang up high. Can't quite connect a shot just yet. Keto will. Not these deagles. Not again. Dude, they're still having nightmares of the end of that first half. Nevera sees a second player over by the pit. Tabson commits versus Shocks with the P250. Tabson now comes up with the Galil. He could kill everybody. He just one man armies into middle. Yeah, no, you're right, Calm right? Down, like, you're man. right. It is. <laughs> Stop it, it's whining. 10 8. <laughs> yeah, it's, that's a good map for you. It's kind of weird. Nobody wants to be that guy. Nevera is like, what did I get myself into? Yeah, right? Yeah, Searson's reminding him. Oh my, oh my goodness. God. That was just an incidental Dude. hit, too. Ooh. And he gets the. <laughs> oh. Yeah! Uh, the, the Bruce. 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 Called Bruce. Up into Cat. Tabson. Gonna have some supportive. Utility thrown outward. Zewu does catch a headshot on the back of the A site, so suddenly it's only Tizian. This is a great chance for Vitality to get back into the site. Good damage from Tizian's frag grenade. Can he land the headshots? Not quite. So three clean kills. Despite damage going back the other direction, this was fully Vitality's round to take. Force your way up, Cat. See if the rotation can come in. Uh-oh. And it works out pretty well. Now... It's just down to Zanteras trying to save back in the tunnel so he'll grab the wildfire. I learned about the skin. I know about skins now. Do you? Yeah, I'm a skin survivor. Yeah. How'd you like uh, skin survivor? I enjoyed it very much. Ooh. What kind of boost was it? Like, was it over top of the door technically, or was it? Yeah, it's like there's a like uh, it's like in the in the rounded arch of the doorway. There's this little tiny angle. Okay. 
Yeah, I want to see it more, but in the meantime, what we're going to see is Apex ch charging out long <laughs> on his own and taking a second player. Meanwhile, Bomb's about to walk out onto B. Keto in position. And we've got Apex versus Tabson by Long A. Apex getting his third kill of the round. He has done everything for Vitality here in the 23rd. Two versus fours, they never should have. I think they closed both the maps, in fact, winning 2v4 situations. Why are we throwing nades? Whoa. Now they're losing bodies. There, there's only one player on the A site. Keto, he's going to walk into upper tunnels. Xantara's just killed Zewu's teammate back behind him. And if he sprints to the A site, Zewu could catch him. He will. Okay. He just had to out, He just had to make Keto miss a shot. Yeah. He could have easily died in that. And for that reason, they pick him up. Keto on the back site of B. Whoa. Already starting to get pinched as Shox has tucked himself into mid, but Keto finding Zewu over smoke. RPK trades that one. Apex falling down onto Searson as Shox comes into the plate. Zanterez off of A. 1v2. Had he dealt with Shox, he was on for the clutch. But it's Vitality with 14 rounds. And an aggressive cat setup from Big and Shox. He might get caught off guard. The nades go too deep and he might, oh my god, capitalize hard off this as they're backpedaling, but it's now four on three for Vitality. Cat Control Tizian will try to make up for it. Great oh. aggressive deep angle here to try to catch Navera. Will it work? It does. Good patience. Man, he saw an entire arm and decided not to go for it. Keto taking damage holds his ground. Man advantage. Vitality, they could be walking right into the A-site. Tizian in an awkward spot, able to win his duel. Zewu on the other side, 1v3. Tizian playing the smokes to perfection. Utility comes over the top. There's no one to be found. How long does he stay on default? He's got one flash left over. Still hasn't found an exit route from this bomb site and Big Clan like a trident coming in from three directions looking to pierce this site hold. Molly on the mark and so is the headshot. A second from Zewu. He shuts down Tizian and Keto with an off looking to close the distance. Flash thrown towards ramp predicts the peak and gets into the cover to clutch. Zewu, incredible 1v3. He grabs it on match point. I can't believe it. Maybe Shock showing some leadership in this moment, looking for the entry as they Whoa. rush towards B. Two players in the site, they know it. Oh, good crucial kill there from Keto. Santara's just gonna try and tuck underneath the windowsill. He is predicted and dead. However, they did get an additional kill before Keto goes down himself. So man advantage up for big. Shocks and Nevera in the clutch. Both of these players should be inspired oh with what just transpired with Zewu on the A site. Let's see if Nevera can deliver. He's got 23 kills to his name. 81% headshot percentage. It's in the blood. And Big Clan in mid. He's gonna get aggressive by the looks of it. Shaves off Searson. Now Shox has the back turned. A second coming in for Vitality. And Tapson gets popped. 16 12 for Vitality. Taking Big's map pick and poising themselves to top group two. That T side had everything. A lot of great strats, a streak of rounds. Interesting. And then we'll see what happens on Inferno, which is also quite a low win rate map for them. But that's also more common to be below 50% and still find yourself, you know, being competitive. Ow. Those hurt. Big Clan just going to take the fight to Vitality instantaneously. Shox is standing on top of the hut ramp, but down he goes. Big Clan, congrats. You've won yourself a pistol. The first pistol round win. That man, he looked like a, look like a crazed killer. I am, I am the hut. Oh my god, look, talking about crazed killers. Look at the way they're sprinting into this. A double kill off of Keto's frag grenade. Joey, I would love to please have that replay. I want to see the carnage. I want to see the chaos. I want to see the kills. Fuel the kills. Be the killer. As Keto is. Four frags for him. Oh, shakalaka. That's a... Exactly. <laughs> we need... <laughs> <laughs> Is this bad? Fast cross oh. outside. Oh, Apex. Just going right through smoke. And, well, there was a totem pole from Big inside the garage. Molly at the feet of the hut rush. Or at least what was supposed to be the hut rush. Options are somewhat limited, but because they are out in front of Mini, there is the opportunity to come through with a Lurk Frag and Keto. He will get cooked. First thing on the barbecue 
Yeah. Burnt all the way to a crisp and Zebu left alone. 1v4 situation. Tizzy in back of the site, anchoring upper and having no trouble with it. Just a fall must do his name. He's going to make contact with Searson, who will absolutely land the shot. They pushed him back. They've done damage. Plus, they got an opening kill, and now they're wrapping into heaven with five alive. <gasps> Unless Tabson can come back into this. Yeah, he should have just seen the shadow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100% just saw the shadow. He knows they're up there, which is why Tizian takes a deeper position inside of Mini. Will find one kill, but now Shox drops as the bomb had already. Can Tabson find an angle onto RPK? Seems unlikely. Unless RPK gives it to him, gifts it to him. Apex is still outside alone, and if he peeks towards heaven right now, he can still find Tabson, but that's not going to happen because he's focused over on the squeaky door, and he will get Xanteras first and foremost, but he's playing trigger discipline. He gets them both. Awesome play by Apex. Now Shox can adapt to that and just not expose himself to heaven, which could have been the corkscrew in this 1v2, and instead it falls flat. Apex Excellent three-piece. A few other players. It wasn't actually just Apex to get them set up and get the bomb down. And Searson, oh my god, he actually goes down again, opping before he can even take a shot. One bulleted by the AK. Zaiwu will follow up. Of course, I meant Zaiwu. I spoke to Apex, he told me. In France, we don't say the names incorrectly. Keep saying Zaiwu. And how'd that make you feel? Empowered. Do you feel the power? Keto does. But not for very long. RPK trades that one back. Four survivors for Vitality. And deliver. But now he's got to be a bit weird. And look at that. Dude, Searson is getting bullied. Yeah, he's getting straight bullied. Absolutely bullied. They're all by nice shots, mind you. But he is getting absolutely destroyed. He's not even given a chance to find impact in these rounds. And I mean, he, could he have been further from where he had previously died? Zanteres already on this B site gets himself three kills to close. That's why we named that spot after him. <laughs> That's literally why that spot is called Zantaris. Multiple kills on the round. He did good. Apex going to fall off of Mini. Tizian definitely hears that. So Searson puts an end to it real quick. But he sees that close utility being thrown at him and decides to just retract back to his spawn. You can see, like, there's, like, position one outside where he's an easy kill. Actually. Yeah, credit yep. card. Smoke fades. Catches a second, even. Masuda will find his second kill of the half. But already two frags the other direction. RPK swings squeaky door. That's Vitality confirming both of their spots. And Masuda... Well, how does he find a way back into this one? 15 seconds left over. He's going to have to die. He will take one player with him, but 7 HP and not a chance. An eighth round on the CT side for Big. Ooh. Even despite turning back the other direction, Tabson gets bested. Now, there is a CT up in the rafters. That's going to be Tizian. Keto could be here to pull the tension, and Xanteras may well just do it all. But Ziwu puts a quick end to that. And he anticipates a peak on the left side of sight. Doesn't anticipate Tizian, who gets two kills and sets up Keto so perfectly. Yeah, hats off to Keto for that. Oh, hell yeah. Like Just like you're about to bring up. Hmm. Xanteras to be tested on ramp. It's been a while since we've seen a little ramp action. Let's see what he can deliver. One. And Get maybe done. Falls back. Searson comes into the play. Two players already up close. Ziwu toying with it. Gonna cost him. And RPK answers back. But it's a two versus four situation. And Bomb needs to be retrieved. Tabson tucked behind credit card. He's shuffling his feet. CT smoke falls down from heaven into hell. And RPK can't quite close it. Apex is turned to clutch, also caught by Xanteres. Awesome CT side coming alive here from Big. He who doesn't die. I like this, man. Change of look. Searson getting hyper aggressive, takes a shot to the face, and still delivers the kill. RPK delivers an opening closer to this A site. Vitality starting to work, but there's also answers back, including a frag onto the bomb carrier. RPK barely alive, and Apex, he's been spotted. Who the hell plays from there? Tabson, damn it. He's got himself the answer, and he's got himself 100 health. 
compared to the other two players still kicking. RPK almost getting them all lined up, but nicely done. 12-3 from Big. Well, we'll see if they can still get in a few reps before this one should be done. Okay. Oh, man, Zantares, huh? He's going to come back up to the squeaky door where Searson resides. Well, but they know he was searching down there, but he's already upstairs again. Mm-hmm. It could be just easily three players walking down onto the B site for big. Keto will kill Masuda. RPK got back behind second vent. Empty-handed on his death, but shocks he's back behind them, and they're going to close that door. Ziwu attempts his best to get out and into the fight, but now shocks try as he might. He's completely cut off from everything. I love the play there for Big. Send the bomb, double up in vent, and get that 13th round easy. Yeah. Now it's like, Keto's um, like, you deal with it. How are you going to deal with it? Searson tries to jumping Mac 10 into shocks. One and done. Scout play from Apex. Goes down empty-handed. Damn, Santeros is having a map, man. Mm. 20 kills, 6 deaths at the moment. Top of the scoreboard here on Nuke. Smokes off Decon, nobody peeks. Masuda's got the MAC-10 by double doors. And RPK's coming down to join him. Two versus three, and Zantara's patience should be perfect. Or he gets caught actually falling off of the control panel. And because of that, things get a little awkward. Things get a little weird. He just saw the player on the back of the site. So now RP, oh my god, he doesn't even need the info because Masuda hits the headshot. Now it's all on Tizian, but they have to figure out where he is. And he fires off versus RPK. Masuda peeking into it, just barely getting the kill. A quarter of his health remains. Different perspective. Should be time. Oh, wait, yeah, that's super close. Wow. Turns green. And Masuda's eyes turn red. He also just slips back into secret for a moment, comes back into it, and loses his head. Does substantial damage, but with Tabson's follow-up frag, it's just not nearly enough anywhere for Vitality. Shox is going to go ahead and flank Lobby with three players in position, but they're just around the corner. So he kills the guy in Hut first and foremost, then the lineup for RPK. Shox gives chase. They could have just ejected down the vents. Instead, he seeks the save. Um, I like the play that Shox made, actually, 4v5. It sucks that nobody else got a kill. That would have made things more interesting, but when he dropped down the vent after taking a lot of damage, I don't, I don't, I don't want to rag on it too, too much, but I have, so I'll stop. Let's see if Shox can deliver. He gets himself the first one. They're going to start shooting through the floorboards, and he does a good enough job of doing damage. RPK, little jiggle peek, clears up two. Searson, though, he's got two frags to his name. Looking for the 1v2 clutch. And he hears the footsteps behind him, but can't do much. Vitality take a six. They are still trailing by eight. Shocks. Oh my god, yeah. Four players go by. He turns his attention. One, two, three. <laughs> Why'd you have to say it like Four. that? Four. Okay. No, <laughs> Can't count. Yeah. Him. Oh wow, he actually does get it. And Tizian's just falling out of the vent. <laughs> not much meant to be in that one. Apex. Throws down the smoke grenade just in time. Keto's gonna run right through that. Apex trying to dodge flashbangs, picks up a second, and that's enough to convince Big to redirect here. Apex does enough. Can Vitality hang on? 25 seconds remain. RPK, he's about to peek into the squeaky, does substantial damage. Ziwu up in heaven, covering Vent, gets off by Searson, and we now have Big back with an edge, but Apex has slipped through lobby, caught by Tabson, Masuda, completely burned out of the play, never even has a damn chance. And that should have just been icing on the cake if someone just got a trade upstairs, anyone. anyone. But no one did, and then he gets an unlucky timing, even though he was very fast on the flank. Double up setup to try and stop the first of seven map points. Santera's wasting zero time getting in through mini. Apex now knows that Outdoors is compromised, but as he runs forward, he catches the back of Taps and another player crossing into Garage goes down. Apex, excellent double kill. And a 5v2 to close. Minute 20. Keto peeks out from Garage, catches Apex back with a frag, and doesn't lose any HP, so decent start. 
to an unlikely. So yeah, they're gonna have to just concede as they fall back into the CT spawn. Shocks. Ooh wee! Gets the first one, not the second. <laughs> Tizian, he will escape. They actually, they, it's happened. Never forget. Ooh, Ziwu opens up. Oh my God, he's got a second. I mean, they can not flash him and keep peeking. Try. Tap not going to get any easier. Oh my God. Oh. Ziwu, 23rd frag on the scoreboard. Tizian's trying to get himself an exit onto ramp, but Shox is going to close that one down. And Zantara is now with everything to do. A deflated Zantara moseys across the outside yard. Only to get decimated by Ziwu. Oh man, it's a fast door pop. Tizian coming, sprinting into the site. Doesn't catch Masuda up on Hut, who will kill him as Ziwu finds another impo impactful op frag. Impossible? Yes. It... Impactful? Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Shox is gonna kill them. One, two, three. Un, deux, trois. Frag grenade chucked out. Minimal damage. Ziwu catching Tabson outside leaves everything on Big's ramp hit. They walk into Shocks, who shuts down the first and second. Not quite the third. Not this time around. It's a little trickier when Big have guns. And take Keto out. But it looks like Keto's turning his attention. <gasps> in. Oh my, god. oh my god. That's an opportunity. Executes the first. Player down beneath will close it though. RPK shooting him through his feet. Gives Vitality their 14th. Minimal utilities. Apex getting into position, finding the first frag. That's a 5v4, but his back is turned to Tizian, who he lost track of down in the vents. They're able to get Bomb back, moving it over to the depths of the site. They will ensure their plant. Retake is on. Tons of utility for Vitality. They've got lobby control, which means ramp control. Shox is over here towards control. Room. But Searson's already inside it. Watching the stairs, he looks away and still gets back into control of it. Xanterez is going to play close. And this could be, should be, Big shutting it down. So many rounds in a row. But the final hurdle is where they seem to trip. Unless Masuda swings big, but he falls. Searson with the AK headshot, 16-14. Both these teams exchanging map picks and leading us into Inferno. You know, Slotted. make up this map and maybe reach new heights. So we'll see. A testing ground. Keto, he's still back by Alt Damn. Apex. He's been the he's been predator. Great. Just slaps Tabson back on his attempt. Nevera will get the duel inside of the apartments. Remember the bomb's been thrown out on A lane. There's like there's like 17 players inside of the pit. So really, even with Nevera dying here, how the hell do Searson and Keto get this bomb back? Look at this, man. It's a it's have a to make a fire devil to get this bomb back. It is Halloween after all. Yeah. So to bend the finger on the monkey paw or whatever it is. Ooh, there's Take one. Cursed deal. CT's giving him 1v1s, man. Okay. You got nothing to lose here, Searson and Keto, and they make it seem like they're gonna win this time. Ah! Oh my god. Ah! No, okay. No. No way. Okay. Keto will keep trying here, but he's got 20 seconds to die. They all decide to charge. Oh my god. Uzi Wu gives him a chance, and Keto now just one headshot away. Apex tries to charge it. The gun goes dry. Nine shots left. Ten seconds on the clock. Keto goes upwards. Eight seconds left, and he gets it. The last bullet nearly. Three kills when he had no business winning. Then you've definitely got to do it on a map like Dust2 and then Inferno. I love this. We'll see. If it pays out. So far, Big Clan 3-0, 5v4. Apex gonna try and catch Keto, but both players blinded. Apex regains vision and denies the bomb carrier. Santeras, though. Four players for Vitality on low HP, and he connects the spray into the head of Apex. Instantly starts sprinting over, but Ziwu waiting for the frag. Bomb thrown back down to the dirt. Tizian on the other side of the map. Sure enough, 20 seconds on the clock to clutch. And there is still one man lingering longer for Vitality on this A site. And he's not even concerned about the round win. He's talking about why are they losing here? Why are they dying here when they don't need to? Why do you let Zintaras hit that? 
his team will not forget. He's gonna have the smoke fade in his face, but he has a smoke in his hand. Tabson absolutely gonna punish that one. Apex can't quite catch the player as he jumps over Arch, and Tabson goes back for second servings. But we do have Big Clan down in pit, and still one up on Balk. It's Santeras to clear the first, traded by Masuda, doubling into this, and the 1v3 not even. We're speaking dust two of See if he has the stamina for two maps in a row. Yeah. Well, two maps in a series. You Big got a break on. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh wow. Flash goes forward, as does Tabson. He is the bomb carrier, so they kind of have to follow suit. But Nevera doing a very good job of just shutting down the apartment's control. Masuda getting a bit of aggression thrown his way. Trade for RPK. Tabson down with bomb on the tank's feet. And if he just sits on it, it's going to take more than a couple men to move it. Searson missing the op shot in close proximity, leaves Keto last man standing yet again. A 1v4, 30 seconds, no bomb, and he's just completely wrecked by that frag, but he is still fighting, damn it. If only he had a teammate. If only he still had time. If only he had 100 health, but he has one HP, and that is taken quickly away by Ziwu. Vitality now in the lead. See if they can put an end to Vitality's streak. But Masuda looks to be unleashed. However, caught out by Tizian. He had just heard the jump into the window, so his crosshair set to the right. Xanteras hmm, might die to RPK. He's going to walk down here for the duel, trades it off. Nicely done. Hmm. RPK didn't get that first kill, so he looked for it elsewhere. Ziwu now focusing on Boiler. He just got stuck on the wall and, and still, still, adjusted. still adjusted. Like, holy cow, man. It's still not enough. Good job, Big. They've broken through that five-round streak. Watch for her. They're going to flash into the pit. Close to hay bales is RPK. Players up above him. Props to Xanteras for clearing straight down. Yep. Now Masuda's in the pit, fully blind, trying to hide. Shots sail by, and frags land in. Another immediate save. Awesome round for Big Clan, dude. Just swarming that site with both bodies and utility. Bomb pops. Sixth round of the board for Big. Look at this. You can, you can try and hide, RPK. You know, considering the only thing he could see was his head. It's kind of surprising that yeah, he didn't see that. <laughs> Yeah, that's very true. No armor. Alone in B. They're going B. Okay, let's let's see Zewu. He's mad though. He's mad now. Okay, no, he's dead. <laughs> Pearson's on him. Yeah. I don't I don't think this is about Zewu dying in B. It's about Zewu being left alone in B. That's what this is about. That's the problem? It's not no no banana control, leaving him alone in B. Let's put it this way. If they knew where the T's were, he wouldn't be by himself. Yeah, page one says, once upon a time. Second page says, second page, dead. And the third page is the end. I could get through that pretty quick. Focusing onto the A site. Three players strong up short. Masuda dropping the ball. Can Nevera recover? He's blinded. And RPK just got a single kill on his own. Nevera focused because Tabson, oh. or rather Searson, has completely stolen his. Ta Tabson? They just didn't get the bomb. They had the bomb on the site. They instead. What? After the trade came out, they had killed the guy on cold. Bomb was third man in. Reload could serve as a trigger because the smoke fades at the exact same time. Ziwu, we've seen him cleared off this spot by Searson once, and it oh. happens yet again. Oh my Apex God. dead as Tabson finds the headshot. A three versus five to deny the seventh round for Vitality. And Searson, well, he'll lose out to Nevera. Well, that's a big trade, isn't it? Huge. 3v2 swung back. They won't have Molotovs for the back of the site, but they will have flashbangs. Down goes RPK, however. And now they know Tabson's position, but Tizian back over by Banana. He's going to get them walking into the open. It's all on Nevera. Swapping to the M4. He's dead. Big Clan winning the 3v5. They know when to make adjustments. We just didn't see some of them coming in. Okay. And now another test. We know that also Apex calls a very strong T-side, in my opinion. Very, very strong. So we'll see if he can pull that off again today. Nobody's going to check Searson fast enough, but Masuda will turn tail onto him. Now Tabson's in a tricky spot. Nice second kill coming in from Masuda. Mm. Working the Glock wonderfully. Is he? Oh, wow. yes, he is. Able to get the third. 
This guy's the Nevera of pistols. Seems so. Now he's going to continue towards the B site, joining forces with the other two players who have come up from Banana. Minute on the clock, and Tizian's cleared. They could go to A for free, but they're going to take they're a They're thinking chance. about it, aren't they? Bomb still in Banana, just giving Apex a chance to clear this. Bomb is going to go away to secure the, uh, the round. Ziwoo going to charge up with the MAC-10, and he's got Xanteras dead, doubling back at the P250 of Tabson. That may cost them. Of course, there is still the double CT stack up on this B site. Kido buying time, moves through smoke, gets the headshot into Nevera. Is RPK their savior? 25 seconds, commits to the bomb plant. Tabson could come out on his own, or does he wait? RPK reloads, his back completely exposed, and Big Clan clean up. A robbery of a round here in the 17th. They're trying to influence the rotation back. It's gonna be what looks like a fake. I'm not sure if they're committing here. Gunfights unfolding both sides of the map, moving the bomb closer to the A site. They squeezed it long enough, but Santera is the landmine on this A site. Oh man, he kills RPK and Ziwu. Swaps over to the Galil. Oh Zanteres! Oh. Wow! Absolute shutdown. We might see this full commit. Let's take a look at our players in the site, set up with a flash. Tamsin up top. Oh my god, doesn't spread to him. Oh, still gets cleared by Nevera, who has RPK get that second. So, efficient trade frags, man advantage up for Vitality. Searson won't be able to get the impact. Back and forth and back and forth we go. Mm -hmm. Disney gets a we, parting gift. We we know what the game is there, right? It's it taps in up top. He's got to get the first kill. If he gets a kill and some damage, and the keto can play off of him, gets the next kill, and then they have like a successful hold and a retake can ensue. But taps in, he drops like. Again, the kind of minimal pieces we've seen Big Clan rob rounds with before. Searson can't flick fast enough. Zantara's AK at bat, empty-handed, and Tizian. He's just fading away there by dropping the incendiary. Tizian, when are you gonna swing? Oh my god. He actually just dodged Ziwu from Boiler. Tabson in the meantime, catching the head of Masuda and a second into Apex. A peek in mid that could have gifted him a third. But it's Nevera instead with the 3k. Keto. He's on the bomb site, not again. He's just hiding. And it's cleared. And the bomb stays all the way back, which yeah. is cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So let's see what's going on with him. Searson, I love the aggression. Oh, and he gets RPK on the second shot. Ziwu burning to a crisp. How is he alive? There's no way they expect it. They don't need logs because they think it's Molly. Oh, oh and he gets God. the kill. <gasps> I feel like it was Gaben and Sergey. They work together. <laughs> Santeras chance here for a multi-kill, but absolutely countered. Damn. Tizian towards the pit, peaks. Sees more than he can handle on his own. But he'll try his damnedest. Does shut down the first player. Trying for the headshot. Nevera labored kill, but he gets there in the end. His second to the scoreboard here in the 23rd round. Looks like Vitality will take a lead. Oh, that's a critical one, man. And, and then, then he, he knows stops he can... damaging him. You know, like, yeah, no, it's the end. It's, the, it's, the, yeah. it's like the it's final the player of the Molotov yeah, yeah. at the end, and it doesn't do enough. The so player up. They could just they could just pop. Yep. Off the flash they'll go. Tizian this time has a gun, but still can't handle the heat. Xanteras and Searson with a kill apiece. And we've got Ziwu in pit. He's got teammates coming over. The utility buys time. RPK could cut off this rotate, but will the players on site survive? So far, so good. Xanteras dropped down to 22. Keto, last man in, and the only man still standing for Big Clan. That was a pressure cooker for both teams. A crucial moment where either could have picked this back up, but it's not over yet. Keto gets the headshot to RPK. He could take the chance here. He could deny Vitality that 14th. They're trying to get the easy road here for match point. Keto, Gotta be a risk. Like, if he moves in and somehow wins this, that's a, like the in most insane club ever. So we will jump up, grab the frag. Tabson could and can flash himself through this. We've got Keto back sight, landing damage. Check out the HP of Vitality. It's not perfect, but they'll get both those kills. Rotates over fast enough. Apex hands busy with bomb. He gets the plant down. 
Searson's got a bit of a smoke to play around, and he is getting ever closer, dangerously close, in fact. Furthers the damage into Nevera. Zantera's and Tizzy in 2v3. Ah, but empty-handed is the Turkish delight. And Tizian, this should be good night. Vitality looking a 15th round in the eyes. He's got a frag grenade and a little bit of chip damage versus RPK. Trying to commit to this, Molotov forcing him forward. Vitality with four match points. Yeah, pretty impressive, man, to be able to pull this back. But because they had a player already on the other side, they're confident to follow forward with it. Oh, but a perfect dunk onto Masuda. And then this smoke doesn't have somebody already penetrated through. Tapson could be screwed as he spams onto the smoke. He has to go for the reload. Ziwu trades it. And now we've got three members of Vitality on the site. But Nevera screwed over by the smoke spam of Tabson. Tabson, just unconfirmed damage. Ziwu, does he go back at the SOP? There's an, the wildfire's right in front of him. He knows no one's on B now. He's got Flashing a flash for the peak. Yeah. Apex dies out. Now it's all on Ziwu. 1v4, two CTs on coffins, and that is all she wrote. For round 27, Big Clan take a 12th. Yeah, of course. No, that's just going to happen. It is what it Semi is. Am I realistic, of course? And Tough what? One. Oh my god, this is where it ends. They've only got one person here. Oh, okay. Well, again, another perfect call, right? Just <laughs> bigger, like, just like, well, they'll probably go yeah. A. I mean, they've okay, we'll got to try and play this, man. Does this end with a whimper? because it's sure enough not a bang on that B site. They walk in, they get their kill, they get their bomb plant, and Big may very well be regretting that they only had one player on site. What goes around comes around. What Big themselves abused versus Vitality CT side, getting Ziwu solo B round after round is what could spell victory for Vitality. They're gonna try and just barrel through the smoke grenades. Tapson's on the site, but a 1v5, it's over. Vitality taking away Inferno, bringing Nevera onto a new map as he top frags alongside RPK, 24 kills apiece.